Hello and welcome to the session. In this session, we will discuss a question which says that find the equation of the plane through the points 3, 2, minus 2 and minus 2, 4, 5 and is perpendicular to the plane 2x minus 3y plus 5z is equal to 10. Now, before starting the solution of this question, we should know some results. First is the equation of a plane passing through the point x1, y1, z1 is a into x minus x1 the whole plus b into y minus y1 the whole plus c into z minus z1 the whole is equal to 0. Let this be equation number 1 and if 1 passes through x2, y2, z2 then the equation will be a into x2 minus x1 the whole plus b into y2 minus y1 the whole plus c into z2 minus z1 the whole is equal to 0. And secondly, the planes a1x plus b1y plus c1z plus d1 is equal to 0 and a2x plus b2y plus c2z plus d2 is equal to 0 are perpendicular if a1 into a2 plus b1 into b2 plus c1 into c2 is equal to 0. Now these results will work out as a key idea for solving out this question. And now we will start with the solution. Now we have to find the equation of the plane through these points and which is perpendicular to this plane. Now given the plane is passing through the point 3, 2, minus 2. So using this result which is given in the key idea, the equation of any plane through the point 3, 2, minus 2 is given by a into x minus 3 the whole plus b into y minus 2 the whole plus c into z minus of minus 2 which will be c into z plus 2 the whole is equal to 0. Now let this be equation number 1. Since it passes through the point minus 2, 4, 5. Therefore, the equation of the plane is now by using this result which is given in the key idea. Now, this equation of the plane which is given by equation number 1 passes through this point that is minus 2, 4, 5. Therefore, the equation of the plane will be a into minus 2 minus 3 the whole plus b into 4 minus 2 the whole plus c into 5 plus 2 the whole is equal to 0. This implies minus 5a plus 2b plus 7c is equal to 0. Now let this be equation number 2. 
Now this is the equation number 1 which is the equation of the plane. Now it is given that the plane which is given by equation number 1 is perpendicular to the plane 2x minus 3y plus 5z is equal to 10. Now using the condition of perpendicularity since the plane which is given by equation number 1 is perpendicular to this plane therefore a1 a2 that is a into 2 plus b1 b2 that is plus b into minus 3 plus c1 c2 that is plus c into 5 is equal to 0. Now this implies 2a minus 3b plus 5c is equal to 0. Let this be equation number 3. So this is the equation number 2 and this is the equation number 3. From 2 and 3 we have minus 5a plus 2b plus 7c is equal to 0 and 2a minus 3b plus 5c is equal to 0. Now solving these two equations by the method of cross multiplication. We get a over 5 into 2 is 10 minus 7 into minus 3 is minus 21 is equal to b over 7 into 2 is 14 minus minus 5 into minus 5 is minus 25 is equal to c over minus 5 into minus 3 is 15 minus 2 into 2 is 4. Now this implies a over 10 plus 21 is 31 is equal to b over 14 plus 25 is 39 is equal to c over 15 minus 4 is equal to 11. Now let this be equal to a constant say lambda. So this implies a is equal to 31 lambda, b is equal to 39 lambda and c is equal to 11 lambda. Now this is the equation number 1. Now putting the values of A, B and C in equation number 1 we get 31 lambda into x minus 3 the whole plus 39 lambda into y minus 2 the whole plus 11 lambda into z plus 2 the whole is equal to 0. Now dividing throughout by lambda this implies 31 into x minus 3 the whole plus 39 into y minus 2 the whole plus 11 into z plus 2 the whole is equal to 0. Which further implies 31x minus 93 plus 39y minus 78 plus 11z plus 22 is equal to 0. Which implies 31x plus 39y plus 11z is equal to 149. So this is the required equation of the plane. And this is the solution of the given question. And that's all for this session. Hope you all have enjoyed the session.